What's up guys, Rex34 back with another epic opening and we have some insane packs. We got Generation Force guys. We never pulled the number 17 ghost. So you know what that means. We gotta pull it. First edition, the Shining Darkness could pull the Blackwing Dragon Ghost for our first edition. That'd be crazy. And then of course, Battles of Legend. We wanna pull the epic 10k or the Utopia Starlight. And before we get started, the giveaway for this video, I'll be giving away these three cards. We got a Gaia, the Magical Knight of Dragons. XX Saber Gotham's and a Des Volstgolf. Golf. What is this? Volstgolf. I always you say Volstagraph. I don't know why, but it definitely doesn't say that. So yeah, whatever that is, Gold Series. All you have to do is like the video, be subscribed, and let me know what you want to see pulled from these packs. Also, I hope you guys enjoyed the premiere of the Invasion of Chaos. Make sure you check that out if you haven't seen it. That was an awesome opening. There were some pretty insane, pretty insane pulls. Yeah, so let's get into this, guys. Make sure you use my TCG Player eBay affiliate links if you want to support the channel. All you have to do is buy what you're going to buy anyway. It supports me, so I appreciate it. And we're going to get into some Battles of Legend. Let's see if we can pull something cool. And then I'm really excited. If we pull in the number 17 Ghost, guys, look. It looks incredible. I want to pull. I have the ulti, ulti rare. <laughs> Ultimate rare. So now I'm like, okay, we got to get the Ghost down. I saw a few more packs for sale. I was like, yeah, let's grab these. Then Shining Darkness. I did open a Shining Darkness booster box. We were on network. There we go. A while ago, it was a year ago actually at this point. So make sure you guys go check that out. I'll put that up there. It's gonna be a little bit more cringy probably, but I uh, got some pretty good pulls out of it. It was pretty cool. It was a lot cheaper back then, so that was cool. But let's go ahead and try a Generation Four. So we opened a few. Oops, we pulled two. So I guess we'll set that one there. Yeah. So we want to pull the number seventeen. There's also a Hero Lives in here. That's a pretty uh, pricey card. Ultimate rare, what the heck? Okay, there we go. Crash Bug Y. We've seen a lot of these cards before. If you guys have been watching for a while. Fly Fang, Crash Bug X, and Wind Up Dog. So we have seen a lot of Generation Force. We've opened a bunch of them. We finally did pull the ultimate rare, the uh, Leviathan Dragon, which is honestly like unusual because you usually don't pull the ulti first. Like with Tachyon and uh, Cross the Cross Souls one, Clear Wing. Oh, there we go. Oh, fish! Skipped right to it. Milla the Temporal Magician is in here. All right, yeah, we're, we're, I'm pretty excited about the Shining Darkness ones too because they have a $30 super in there, that um, Infernity Mirage guy. He's like 30 bucks, it's insane. So, could pull some good stuff out of there as well. Okay, let's go with one of these. We have 13, the Shining Darkness first edition. So this is pretty cool. This set is pretty old. I think it came out in 2011 or so. It's like nine years old. Getting old at this point. Here we go. Let's see if we can pull something cool. First edition, The Shining Darkness. Oh, ho, ho. how about a secret rare right off the bat? Gen X Neutron. How about that? First pack, secret rare, first edition. I will take that. I don't know the value of it, but that is pretty sweet. There's also some good rares and commons in the set, so I'm definitely going to be looking out for those. So that's a good start, guys. That's a good start. That is a great start. All right, let's set those there. Okay. Battles of Legend. We have potential to pull some crazy stuff in here. We can pull 10k. We can pull Ghost Rare First Editions. You know, something like that. But, oh, that's a good pack. I think we had that before. It's like a those, that pack comes around on, on its own. Yeah, it does. But uh, pretty often, it seems. Yeah, so here we go. We had about a little bit over 50 packs, I think. So not as crazy as sometimes, but still 50 packs. Pretty good. We, we did a lot of 100 pack openings recently. Not going to lie, guys. Those were fun to open. To edit, they are brutal. They're so long. And when I like, I get home from like coaching a soccer practice or something and, oh, what's going on here? Absolute Crusader. There we go. And it's like eight o'clock or nine. No, it's usually like nine o'clock. And I'm like, well, I got to start editing. Good thing I have a 30, 40 minute video to edit. And I'm like, that's going to be brutal. And then I got to edit it and I got to upload it. And then I got to make the thumbnail. And then by the time it's like, oh yeah, now I got to go package up all my sales stuff. Yeah, so that's that happens. So it's pretty rough sometimes. But still, it's a lot of fun to do that. So yeah, we're going to cut it down to like 50 packs. Let me make it a little bit easier. Okay, I'm sure I'll do more 100 pack guys. And don't worry, don't worry. Dragon laser. Damage gate. We start off with back-to-back -back hollows out of the shining darkness. Damage gate. That's like super dark. That's pretty cool. Okay. Pile Falcon and Trigon. Next pack, let's go to Battles of Legend. Yeah, guys, hopefully my 10K Dragon will come back. The other one I bought, by the way, I bought another one. If you didn't see my YouTube story, make sure you guys check out my YouTube stories. I'm posting over there quite a bit now with some cool stuff. 
And uh, I picked up another one, submitted it. I also submitted the DD Crow, submitted the Triple Tactics, and I submitted the Black Cluster Soldier First Edition. I'm going to submit those unlimited ones as well, but I'm probably going to do that. Not in the Express Service. Okay, here we go. Generation Force. Yeah, Express Service. So it shouldn't take too long to get those back. Hopefully we'll get them back in a reasonable amount of time, you know, a couple weeks. Crash Bug Z. Wind Up Snail. Crash Bug X and Fly Fang. All right. So far, we've gotten a secret rare. That's not bad. That is not bad at all. That is not bad. Number th number S39. I can never say that guy's name. Also, I'm just struggling to say anything right now. Yeah, after pulling after pulling those... Uh, yeah, I won't spoil it. But the Invasion of Chaos. Let's say that. I'm still like, wow. That was awesome. Okay. Blossom Bombardment. Lena. Dragon Laser. The Fountain in the Sky. Walk you. Trigon. Black Wing Strafe. Nothing in that one. The first time we have not pulled a foil out of that set. That's pretty crazy. Whew. Also, guys, don't forget. Oh, Chaos Emperor Dragon. Yes. Another one. We're about to have 10 of these suckers. Over so many packs, but I'll take that all day. That's a sweet card. But yeah, don't forget. 19 and 20k specials are coming up. All you have to do is subscribe, guys. All you have to do is subscribe. It's going to be crazy. We're going to pull Epicness. New Run Network. This is a good box. Let's make it up for that box I opened, uh... When was it? I don't know. It was in it was in a recent video. Oh, it was in the one with the uh, the Dark Magician Girl, the Dragon Knight box. Yeah, we pulled garbage. Uh, well, not out of that. Oh, yeah. By the way, if you want free cards, check out that video. I'm giving away every pull out of the new set. Oh, Secret Rare. Adri Adrius. Adrius? Adrius? Why now? I don't know. Keeper of Armageddon Secret Rare First Edition. Check that out. That is pretty sick. We're getting some fire out of these packs. This is nice. Okay, Generation Force is showing up. They're all showing up, really. So, yeah, we've pretty much gotten a good pull out of every set. Sonya, that's pretty cool. I'm a big fan of that. Maybe we can pull the Ghost with Blackwing. If we pull the Ghost Blackwing, I'm gonna lose it. I'm going to lose it. Watt Woodpecker, Memory Crush King. Testudo Erot Newman, Bombardment. Ally of Justice Core Destroyer. I feel like those all look the same. Is it just me or do Ally of Justice cards all look the same? Okay. That looks just like the Catister or whatever. That ultimate rare in Turbo Pack 7, I think. Okay. Iceberg Narwhal. Let's go into another Generation Force Leviathan Dragon Ghost Rare. Has to be here somewhere, right? You know, I've opened a lot of these packs. A lot of these packs. Ghost Ship. Mass Change. Nothing in that one. Except the ghost ship. Alright. Here we go. Ooh. Elemental Hero is Skiri Dao. So far, fire pulls. Can we can we get something else epic? Even more epic. It's gonna be top to <laughs> tough to top all these secret rares we're pulling. Pull two secret rares, then we pull the Chaos and Bird Dragon, which is, you know, one of the rarer cards from this set. So we're pulling good. Ooh, nice. Oh, lion. Okay. Iceberg narwhal again. Well, let's go into another shining darkness. The shining darkness. Another the shining. It's saying the every time. It's super weird. Okay. Card breaker. Blossom bombardment. Vacuuming. Forbidden graveyard. Quacky mirror shield. Triple A. Gen X undyne is a good one, I think. Trigon. So I'll set that in a nice pile. All right, Armageddon, can you give us something epic? It started off really good in this box, so can't complain too much. Artifact Sanctum, that's nice, and a Mega Fleet. You guys know, you guys know what at this point, which card is good from Armageddon. We've opened a few packs of it. A few packs for the 10K Dragon. Fishing Swaps. Okay. Okay, let's do the Shining Darkness. Let's see if we can pull that Infernity Mirage Super Rare. That would be a nice super since it is 30 bucks, which is insanity. I had one that I pulled from the booster box I opened, and I sold it for 10 bucks. Fernity Inferno, Randomizer, Spore. All right. Here we go, 10K Dragon. Let's do this. Glacial Beast Polar Penguin, the opposite of a 10K Dragon. Make sure you guys let me know if I miss any good commons or good rares or anything like that. 
and I will grab them. Sometimes you guys really are clutch with that. Oh, oh I thought it was it. Number 17, Leviathan Dragon Ultra Rare. Not, not the ghost. We did get the Ultra. You can't complain about that. That's pretty epic. That is pretty awesome. Number 17, Leviathan Dragon. We didn't get the ghost, but we did get an epic Ultra Rare. I was like, oh, we did it. And I was like, never mind. We didn't do it. There's a Judgment and a Fire Flint Lady. Not bad. Okay. We're getting close to the end of Battles of Legend, but that's okay. We've got a lot more packs. A lot more epic packs after this. Weathering Soldier. Alright, let's go Generation Force. Can we pull something big? Can we pull an ulti? Can we pull Leviathan Dragon? Oni Gamer Combo. Okay, let's go Shining Darkness. See if we can pull something epic. Here we go. Ronin Toten. That's nice. Gen X Searcher. Flame Resonator. Battles of Legend Armageddon. Book of Moon. Another Book of Moon. I have a million of those at this point. Let's finish off these Battles of Legend and then we can finish up with the... Um, what am I trying to say? Generation Force and the, the the Shining Darkness. Okay, nothing in that one. So far, well, the box started off really good. It didn't finish too great, so. Oh, Cross Sheep, that's not bad. Skull King, we will never pull Skull Knight again. All right. Let's pull these up. Here we go. Generation Force, guys. Let's pull the number 17. Here we go. Mass Hero Goka, that's nice. They reprinted it though, I think, in uh in Toon Chaos. Alright, the shining darkness it is. Give us some fire. Give us a ghost rare. Here we go. Key Mouse. Phantom Hand. X Saber. Palamoru. Nimble Sunfish. Okay, I pulled this guy a few times. Second booster. And Watt Fox. Oh man. Could have been Infernity Mirage, but 30 bucks. I'll take it. Super rare. Got about 10 packs left here. Let's see what we can pull. Hope you guys have enjoyed this pretty big opening, but not too long, because it's, you know, Battles of Legend, we're flying through those. Iorca. Xyz Veil. Super rare. Okay. Pulled that one definitely a few times. All right. The Shining Darkness. Can we get another, like, can we get, like, an ulti? Another secret? Oh, Intercept Wave. There we go. Ultra rare. That's pretty cool. Ultra rare. We're pulling pretty good out of these 13 packs, to be honest. Not bad. Alright. Generation Force, can you pull us the fire? Can you pull us something insane? That we can lose our minds. Wind up snail. Quill Pin of Gildos is actually a decent card, I think. Last time I saw it was like two bucks. Which is not bad. Quill Pin of Gildos. Um, there's my pile. My pile's getting pretty tall here. Let's go another Generation Force. Alright. No ultis in this video so far. These both have a chance at ultis. Fish and Swaps. Crash Bug Rogue. So maybe we'll pull one. Probably not, but maybe. That would be pretty sweet to pull a, a big ulti. Because there's some really nice ones. Alright. Aorca. Wind Up Juggler. Not a bad card either. Pretty good, actually. I've pulled a few of these. I think they were two or three bucks as well. All right, the Shining Darkness. Come on, shine on our darkness. Okay, that sounds weird. But uh, yeah, make sure it's good. Make something good. Delta Try. Chaos Trap Hole. Okay, all right. I see how it is. I see how it is. Give us the fire. Make sure you guys hit the like button for luck. We need the luck here. Come on. Come on. Oh, Wind Up Magician. Poseidon's Wave. And Cannoneer. All right, six packs. What can we do from these six packs? Oh my goodness, these are like difficult to open for some reason. This one is just like very stubborn. Couldn't get it. All right, past image, cracking, resonance device. Elements of Hero Flash, okay. Okay, are you guys hitting the like button for luck? I need to feel the luck. I need to feel the fire, here we go. Worm call. Synchron Magnet. Ronin Toten, nice. A keys. Ah. Oh. Gen X Undyne, that's nice commons at least. 
Nice commons in that pack. All right, four more packs. Can there be another big pull? We started off hot, and then we've kind of just kind of limped to the finish here. Can we get something big to end it? Can we get something fire? Oh, guys, we got it. We got an ulti. We want cat. We want the number seventeen or a hero lives. Or Piercing Moray. All right, I've never pulled this one, so I will take that. It's a card I don't own. Piercing Moray. Moray, Moray, you know, whatever. Ultimate Rare. I'll take it. I will take it. That's pretty sweet, guys. That is pretty sweet. All right, let's go into Shining Darkness. We got an ulti. I'm happy about that. I don't think it's too pricey, but pretty nice card. Either way. Here we go. Why not? Phantom Hand. Garden Mines. Randomizer and Spore. One pack of each left. Whew, here we go, guys. We can do this. Ghost Rare in the final pack. That would be absolutely insane. Here we go. Overwind. Oh, we got something. Big Jaws. Oh, we got a Fusion. What could it be? Mass Hero Vapor. Actually, a good one. A good Super Rare. Mass Hero Vapor. All right. So this is ending off pretty good. Ken the Shining Darkness. End us with a Ghost. Blackwing Dragon. Come on. That would be pretty crazy. Worm Call. Card Breaker. Ghibli the Searching Wind. Kwaki Mirror Initialize. Blackwing Gust the Back Blast. Okay. Nothing in the final pack. But overall, pretty good. Let's see what we got here, guys. Alright, guys. For our Battles of Legend, we're just going to go through these separately because we all know what uh, is in Battles of Legend. And I haven't seen anything yet, but we got some pretty decent pulls. Pulled up most of the good stuff. We pulled a uh, couple Numeron Networks. Fire Flint Ladies Cross Sheep. We got the Chaos Emperor Dragon, which is obviously the best card besides the uh, two big cards. So pretty good box there. That cost about 90 bucks to factor that into the total whenever I put it at the end. Then we got a couple of Gen X Undines, Ronin Toten. We got a Master of Goku, Absolute Crusader, Damage Gate, Nimble Sunfish, um, Wind Up Juggler, Number 17 Leviathan Dragon Ultra Rare, Intercept Wave. We got a Gen X Neutron Secret Rare, which is pretty, that's pretty sweet. Uh, Adreus, Adreus, Keeper of Armageddon, and an Ultimate Rare Piercing Moray. So overall, we did pretty good. Um, I spent, what did I spend? I think it was eight, eight or seven per pack on the Shining Darkness. I think it was eight. So 13 times eight is 80, 104. And then we spent, Generation Force, we spent $3 per, I think. Or was it four? I think it was four. No, it was three. So it was 19 times three, which is 30, 47 plus 104, 144, 151. It's 151 plus 90 for the uh, Battles of Legend. About 85 is what I spent. 147 plus 85 is 222, 232. So we spent $232. So whatever the total is here, guys, we spent $232 and we got that much back. We didn't make our money back, but we did okay, I think. I think we did all right. Maybe we got to the $100 mark. Maybe. I might not have, actually. So, not too bad. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. And, yeah, make sure you guys subscribe for future content. 19K and 20K coming up. It's going to be insane. And, yeah, see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Peace. Oh! Yes. Oh. Elemental Hero! Dark Bright! Boom! Oh, <laughs>